Well, hello everyone, and this is Peter Brown with Oldshire Weather for the next seven days. I know it's hard to believe that we are here in the middle of September already. We are counting the days down until the official first day of fall. That is right around the corner. Now, starting at our period, I know a lot of you don't want to see this. Yes, it is Friday, September 13th, so Friday the 13th coming up. But we are going to have some absolutely beautiful conditions for you out there. We're going to be seeing temperatures maybe not even in the low 70s. I think this, this high temperature is a little bit optimistic for Friday. I don't think we might may not even get out of the mid and upper 60s on Friday. So very comfortable if you have to be out and about in the Burlington area on Friday. Now, going out at night, temperature is about where they're supposed to be in the low 50s for this time of the year. Now, we're going to be pretty far away from this record high of 92 that we can still see at this time of the year. But when we get towards the start of our next period, we may not be too far away from those temperatures. So summer is definitely not over with us yet. And of course, rounding in our period, look at that, getting close to the third week of September. As you can see, our temperatures keep getting cooler as we head towards fall. Our temperatures should be probably about in the low 70s. And the end of the period would probably be like that, but then we're going to see a real warm-up as we head into the next week. And of course, as you notice, look at this. Our sun is now setting before 7 o'clock at night, so we won't be seeing those really nice long sunsets until we get maybe probably back into the spring. So fall is definitely on its way. Now as we go ahead, I'm going to show you a little bit about what we're expecting for temperatures over the next 7 to 10 days here in the Burlington area. And this map definitely is not reminiscent of fall, that's for certain. Now pretty much here in the Burlington area, the rest of southern New England, and actually almost the eastern two-thirds of the country, Climate Prediction Center is expecting above average temperatures for us. And in our area, that's certainly going to be noted as we head in towards the middle of our period, starting the work week out. And again, looking forward to the week after that, we may see some really warm conditions here. So if you love summer and you love the warm weather, never fear. The fall weather is going to be here, but very briefly. Now as we go ahead, let's take a look at some of those weather and temps coming up for the next seven days. And again, starting out here on Friday, and no, looked like when we put the forecast together we were going to see maybe some spotty showers on Friday. I don't think that's going to be happening. Looks like we're going to have wall-to-wall -wall sunshine starting out our weekend. Again, temperatures probably not getting up into even 72. Probably going to be stuck in the mid and upper 60s. Now as we get into Saturday, might see a spot shower, maybe a thunderstorm around. Temperatures starting to warm up again, up into the upper 70s. Um, if I'm going to say the pick of the weekend, definitely Sunday. Looks like we're going to have beautiful skies. And look at this, temperatures back into the low 80s. And as we get into Monday and Tuesday, we're going to see temperatures on Monday getting up into the mid 80s and maybe a little bit of humidity. So a real feel of summer coming back. Now, tailing out at the end of our period, looks like we're expecting, again, pretty sunny skies, nice weather out there. We might have to tack a few degrees onto the temperatures um, each of these days on Wednesday and Thursday. It looks like we're going to be a little bit warmer. And again, that's really foreshadowing what might be coming here starting next the week. And after that, we might be seeing temperatures in the mid and upper 80s by the time we get there. So, folks, don't worry. I know fall is definitely coming, but we really have that feel of summer still in the air, especially if you're getting out there starting our work week. So, everyone, get out there, enjoy the weather, and have a great week.